All right, guys, it's Jernigan today. Some more sad news. There's been a shooting in Suff Suffolk. It's a Suffolk police confirms a teenager has been arrested following the shooting. So, uh, yeah, I don't know why there's been a shooting in Suffolk today, but uh, very annoying for a lot of people. That uh, There's some more craziness. Brexit withdrawal agreements as well on top of everything else. England Pepe Philip Frieden Mazelson Greenwood will travel to Denmark, which sounds like Norway, and the square for Thursday. National League match after breaching the terms and coronavirus guidance. So, I've got a few bloody beard again. Uh, Southgate has said the police, this is a woman talking on here. You can see on the news channel. And um, I don't know what else I'm going on about this. Let's talk about the Suffolk shooting here. Reports of a shooting involved a 11-year-old plus on their way to school. So why are people targeting people at school of a shooting? As you can see here, there's a bit of thingy on the news here. As it's talking and it's showing you stuff on the news. Of where the things are going on. And happening but the thing is it's very annoying for a lot of people and it's mentioning things you had the thing in Birmingham yesterday with the guy uh, stabbing seven people then killing one 23 year old, is it one 23 year old the 27 year old man who got arrested and they found him on the camera and everything else why is this world getting worse because of these lockdown measures lockdown rules because of the economy's crashing getting worse then you get other things like uh, I don't know, crazy things like I don't know, Boris, the time to report Boris Johnson looking for overing limits to the Brexit withdrawal. So they've got more people talking here about stuff. Don't know what they're talking about. Probably more protesting or um, I don't think it's going to be Black Lives Matter or rebellion. So I've got itchy bloody nose again. You know, how are people going to coming together in the world about these craziness shootings and stabbings just because they they can do it why are they doing it this is the thing they've got no money are they bored are they fed up are they just trying to be noticed by people or are they just that ill in the head on drugs or beer or whatever but the thing is it's not right people want to get on with their lives people want to go where they want to go and walk i'm saying this because it's true people want to feel safe when they walk outside but how can they feel safe when they've got that thing over them you see these people that got stabbed in birmingham by that crazy guy, black guy with a knife. And they say to all of us, oh, black people have it hard. I mean, I'm not saying all black people are like that and all white people are like that, but, you know, they moan about back, uh, Black Lives Matter. What's all my nose here? And they moan about other things that uh, they get treated differently to other people. And uh, every life should matter, black or white. Um... It's just irritating. Let's see here. Let's make, make sure I've read that article right. Uh, was a 15-year-old boy has standard serious injuries. So it said there was an 11-year-old and a 15-year-old that got shot. I mean, it keeps changing. I've read what was on there and what it said. I mean, why are people, people randomly shooting and killing people for no reason? You know, we... Loads of us have shit lives, but we don't go around stabbing and shooting people for no reason. Or you don't wake up, oh, one day wake up, oh, I want to kill this person today and just shoot them and stab them. You don't. There's a lot of craziness in this world, and it probably sickens a lot of people. I'm going to say it because I'm telling the truth. I'm speaking for now, aren't you? It's not right. You wouldn't do it. And there's a guy speaking now in the news about something. I don't know what he's talking about. He's on about something. Um, but anyway, guys and girls, um, more saddening news again in the UK. Two incidents that happened. Will more happen? Will it more than likely? But anyway, thank you for joining me. Give this video a like, a comment, and share it with your friends. Tell me what you think about this. I'm right. What I've said, I'm speaking from the heart. I speak from here, inside me. The truth. Thanks for joining me. See you next video. Peace. And we'll be back again. Don't worry. Peace.